two weight classes, you must smash and fight ready assassin. Gas till I'm passing, I'm double leg, I've been tapping them. Who was the first to bring the smoke straight to Adesanya? This 5'9 middleweight, call me the brown bomber. What's up guys, welcome to the Kelvin Gaslam YouTube channel. That's right, the KG to the double OG just launched the YouTube channel. And today we're gonna be dissecting the 2019 fight of the year featuring yours truly. But none of this would be possible without my sponsor, Jimmy Bars. All right, 250 calories, 19 grams of protein, and seven grams of sugar for you macro nuts. Here it is, get your Jimmy on. Now, this episode wouldn't be special enough without having a special guest, and today my special yes. guest is none other yes. than Triple C. <laughs> okay, today, like we said, we're going to be dissecting my fight from 2019 against Israel Adesanya. And uh, first of all, let's notice here the reach advantage that uh, Adesanya had here coming up uh, in our middleweight fight here. And uh, it was just, it was just uh, uh, eight and a half, nine and a half yeah. inch reach advantage. <laughs> Yeah, I'm horrible at math. Yeah, too, yeah, so. yeah. Don't ask me well, about we'll numbers. Say, we'll say nine and a half. <laughs> <laughs> Eight and a half. Uh, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's just. Uh, but you, but okay, hold on, real quick. But can I say something though too? I mean, look at this. Look, Wait. look at the height advantage right here that he has. This is why, like, even like our our last thing that me and Dimitri, me and Dimitri, we had a conversation on on why size doesn't matter. Again, it's not for the mamacitas. But this was Calvin, Calvin Gastelum. This man had a, a seven-inch reach on him, and uh, and it's crazy to 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 I see know. the fight the way it went. But go ahead, KG. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. A lot of people said, "Hey, KG, you're too small for middleweight." I know, but you know what, Lee? Like, it doesn't matter because I can prove I can fight with anybody in the world, any height, any size. Here's the you proof. Don't, he don't discriminate. <laughs> I don't discriminate. Okay, so this is this will be the first round. This yeah, was kind of the uh, the feeler at first. Wasn't wasn't this the fight when you uh, took your shorts off, dude? When you're coming on, you, you almost, <laughs> yeah, you almost... I did. I got a little too excited. I took my shorts off at the at the beginning at the walkout, and uh, that's all good. So what are you thinking right now, Calvin? I mean, obviously, I remember having this conversation with you for the first time. I didn't I didn't yeah. do it again because you're supposed to fight Robert Whitaker in Australia. Right. I remember like I remember I told I told uh, you know. Uh, Cordero's like, hey man, let's get the team together because Calvin needs to know and I remember that. And, and never and I always remember why he's fighting for what he's fighting for. It was a dream. Yeah. But I didn't get a chance to. Well, I, I felt like the Robert Wooder go. That was you already had that talk. But during this time, I knew by your walk out when you took your damn shorts off, you're so excited. I mean, I what mean, was going by, through your mind? By was? this time, it had been a, a little over a year since I had fought. You know, I, we filmed the Ultimate Fighter show with Rob. Then I had the camp. Then he had to pull out. And then we had to delay the fight until April uh, of that year um, for me to fight. So I was, like, eager to get into the cage. I remember being backstage telling Master Rafael, like, Master, I'm just ready to fight. I'm ready to just throw down, you know. Yeah. And, and he said he got, like, the chills, by the way. Yeah. I, you know. Yeah. I was just eager to get in there and fight, you yeah. know. Yeah. I was just, I, like, hungry. I like, look, at, look at how calm. Look, you're, there's a calmness, but there's a confidence to you, too. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's like Oh and, yeah. And for those who 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 know Calvin, don't know Calvin, this dude is like the sweetest. He's like he's like a teddy bear, <laughs> but but he'll kill you. You know what I'm saying? So he's like he's like that it's sweet fun. teddy bear that carries a knife with him. No, I, I I remember thinking like this is this is it. This is the moment. Now it's time to put everything into to play. This is the moment I become the I become the champion. Yeah. So many years of hard work, dedication. This is it. This is it for all the marbles. Yeah. You know? Uh, I remember coming back from Australia, and uh, I was like, gosh, dang it. So when am I going to be able to fight? They scheduled it for April. April 13th is actually the exact anniversary that I won the Ultimate Fighter oh, wow. in 2013. So this was the sixth year anniversary that I was fighting in the UFC. Yeah, right away. Right away, I see... So right away, I want to be able to 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 match his footwork. Um, be careful of his hands, right? Um, but I also want to see what he's got. I want to see how fast he is. I want to see how he uses his length. You know, all that length, all that space. He needs all that space to be able to fire these long limbs, long kicks. 
Yeah, I, I think I, when I see this fight, but I always look at his legs, man. You, 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 there's kicks to this yeah. side, and there's actually snatches. He is so good with it. He is so good with that. He seems like he's just kind of gliding backwards and also circling away from the cage beautifully. I mean, he's a master at it, you know, and I feel like since we fought, he's actually gotten better at that footwork stuff. Yeah, he, he's adjusted quite a bit. Yeah, but you, you see what I'm saying? Like, you taking that space... And, and, and throwing is what was making Israel extremely uncomfortable. Oh, yeah. We knew that. We needed to put, the, put, put pressure on him because he needs all that space to be able to throw his long limbs. So if we take away that space, then he won't be, have as much pop. I feel, like, I feel like you being southpaw really helped you too. So being short, being a southpaw, and then inside fighting was... Uh, was something that he's probably never necessarily witnessed before. You know what I'm saying? Like, who, who has he fought at the Walter Division who's been 5'9"? Right. Yeah, probably not very many people, you know. Um, but here comes one of the blitz that I, that I had against him. Um, I was able to counter, push his, push his uh, right hand to the other side and come with my own hook. You'll see right here. Yeah. That's you. Just you saying, you know, push um, something else in. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here it is. Here's my blitz. Yep. yep. Oh, Ooh, that beautiful. Yeah, that was a that was a right hook. Yes. Right short or short right. That's beautiful. Yeah, you tapped him, dude. That's already oh. that's already your round, bro. He's, he, uh, yeah. And they didn't count that as a knockdown, unfortunately, because he <laughs> he grabbed onto the fence. But if that fence wasn't there, eh, yeah, he would have he, he would have been flatlined. Yeah, I've been on that night quill. <laughs> but here now, I'm just being uh, cautious. I know I tagged him. He knows I tagged. He wants yeah, to get yeah. me back. Yeah, you're you're blitzing. But I'm telling you, yep. You know, he, but now he, you have to be more calculated about my attacks. Oh, nice, beautiful right hand. You're fighting, Calvin. I think that's what made this fight. Like you weren't, like you weren't necessarily going back so much on this dude. And I think this is the reason why he has success. Where people tend to play more of his range, right. and he tends to kick you. That's I, I I agree. I brought the fight to him. I feel like a lot of people will throw one or two shots and hope that may that'll that'll land, but it doesn't. It's actually usually the third. Or fourth shot. Again. You know, I'm trying to land. I'm trying to throw more than two punches at this time. Yeah. That, but, but, you, but you see, now, now he goes now he, now he goes southpaw. Go southpaw. And, then, and, he, and switches. he late kicked you. But, ah, man. This is where I see opportunities in this <laughs> fight. Calvin, like, like looking back at it, like oh, yeah. snatching that lead leg. Oh, yeah. If you don't kick it, if you, if you don't kick it, you could definitely take I him wish down. I would have had a more heavy wrestling game for this fight for sure and taking advantage of that. Make him wrestle more. Make him a little bit more tired. Um, just use it to my advantage. I don't think I use that to my benefit. Nice. Got in there again, dude. You know, and right there I'm thinking, okay, he's not as fast as he seems. He's not... You know, I'm able to take everything and see a lot of the things that he's bringing to the table. You hear Joe Rogan, Kelvin has drawn first blood. <laughs> yeah. Well, I knew I had to fight. I bring the fight to him. I can't just let it be a, a target to him in front of him. Look at that nice little slip. Yeah, yeah oh. exactly. You know, and I think like, that was a lot a big difference between me and a lot of other people that fight him is I'm able to slip and move inside and, and counter. Yeah. So that's one. That's one of your biggest. That's one of your biggest gifts, man. You have We're, your, you have the ability to anticipate very well. Well, I think like Rob went into that first fight with him trying to utilize some of these same tactics. But it didn't quite work out his way. His head movement wasn't all there, and, and his footwork is great, actually. Yeah. But, you know, he got caught. He didn't move his head. If, if, if you're going to be in the pocket with a guy like Israel, you got to move like how you you're doing. You're, you're like this. Correct. But if you stay here to here with him, that's where he does that limbo hook. Yeah. And that's kind of how he caught Robert. Beautiful. Yeah, almost, almost put nah, him on his butt. No, nah, that, that's a knockdown, dude. They didn't count it. They did not. But, the, but, but round one is yours. Yes, Clearly. round one. Clearly. 
to the one and only KG to the look at look look at Taro. <laughs> Coach T. Coach T. Oh, Coach you got Chad. You got uh, what's his name? Chance on? and Arthur. Yeah, Master uh, Rafael. Hey. So you only had him, dude, and uh, yeah. had Arthur. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, I took Arthur to Australia with me. He had been helping me hey. all throughout camp. Is he still at Kings? No. 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 Fuck. <laughs> Those are... Second round, baby. I thought first round was me. Okay, let's see how this second one goes. Let's go, baby. <laughs> look at him. Look at my face. It looks funny. <laughs> I look funny. It's funny looking at yourself. <laughs> Shit, whoever did your beer, man, you fucking... Jonathan. Yeah, Jonathan. Yeah, he, he cut my hair too that day. Yeah. <laughs> so now I'm thinking, okay, utilize same tactics. Be smart. Be aware. Stay aware. You know, you know he's going to come harder because he just lost that round. So I got to stay even more vigilant, more, more, more aware. You know, I know he's coming with something. He wants to come hard with something. Yeah, she... You can't let Israel start kicking, bro. Once she's once she starts getting into that range of kicking, right? He he'll capitalize on it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. I agree. And, and this is where MMA guys kind of tend to make a a mistake. You're dude. so right. They don't counter off of the kicks. You have to have a response after you get kicked. Have to. Yeah, counter. Or else it's just gonna keep going and going again. Yeah, counter or evade. Look at those nice slips. Yeah, it's nice. Just boom, and you're very subtle with it too. Yeah, it's not a whole big movement. It's just little slips. I even think about it too. If if you were to do just an extra fake, like a double fake, Kelvin, yeah, you'd be able to get a silent hit. So that's something uh, I've, a bit I've, more. I've been working on is smoke, 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 and then throw my power shot. Yeah, right. They're, they're gonna go back. You, smoke, you know what I'm saying? Smoke. I'm trying to throw everything into one too. You know, which should be <laughs> smoke, smoke. And then throw your hard shots. Yeah, get your feet underneath you. Break, yeah, I'm trying to distance. extend myself. I'm extending myself. Because obviously I have to make up for my lack of, of, of distance. Yeah. Yeah, okay, now he's diversifying his kicks. Yeah, he's switching southpaw, switching, switching to orthodox. Yeah, he just went to the body, went to the head. Ooh, caught him again. Got him what, what nice, did you um, jab. I started figuring he was leaving his head too much in the uh, in the center there, so my jab was going straight up, and it started landing. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Right. Yep. You see what I'm saying? There was yeah, another yep. little fake there. Yep. They could have got you inside, dude. Boom! Those leg kicks were freaking hurting. <laughs> uh, yeah, I remember that was, was. I remember after the fight was done, I was like, th "That's what I was complaining about. Those leg kicks." Inside. Yeah, more than anything. More than anything, it was those inside really, leg after kicks. After the fight. Is those oh. inside leg kicks. Anytime he threw one, I was like, oh! Yeah, right there, right there. Fake! Smoke, smoke, pa. Yeah, yeah, I'm just trying but to you're there. Him. That's your range, bro. I'm just trying to go for the kill. But can I tell you something, dude? That that's what's making Israel... He's already swollen the face, dude. Yeah. That you're staying in there. Like, he can't back oh, up yeah. with these dudes. And I'm not giving him any space. He needs all that space to be able to throw his long limbs. Look, he needs that space. But... If I'm moving on the outside like he wants me to, I need to ooh, be out again, offline, ooh. which he I was caught, not there. Yeah, he just caught you. He caught you with that. Uh, I threw my overhand, uh, I overreached, and I stayed on the on the uh, online. He think so you're he, off balance when he threw oh, it. Oh, 100. percent So if was we go crazy? back, if we go back, look at my foot. Look at my foot. Look, uh, right here. Look, look how. Look, did oh, you yeah, see that? Yeah, yeah. So I I, I tripped myself. Um, and he was able to capitalize on that little mistake. Yeah, fuck. And Honestly, besides that little, I thought yeah. you were winning the round. Either. No, I, I, I was. Then I try and fin uh, come on strong after that because I know I'm losing, so I need to make up for it. But I tripped, and then at these, I, I remember studying the fight after I was saying how these little mistakes can cost you at the biggest at the biggest stages at the biggest fights yeah that was one little mistake and, it, and he capitalized perfectly on it yeah and sometimes you're getting you're some you got a little too close where you could have gone like right there like you have the ability to go there but you're kind of and not only that since he noticed i was i was um 
slipping a lot of his straights, he started throwing the hooks yeah. instead of the straight. Yeah, he started, he started looping his punches. Yeah, and he was catching me with it. So he did a good, you know, that's just how good he is. He's able to diverse, like he's starting to swing those. Oof. Okay, you gotta start. You gotta start pulling up them uppercuts too, Kelvin. Yeah. A little demonstrative. Nah, man, I was a completely different fighter back then. I would do so many things different. Nice. Oi. Ooh, ooh. That was so I good. Think that, that was the best shot that he got. That was a really good one. Route. I'll tell you that. I was hurt. Yeah. I don't know why I'm going forward. I was really hurt. <laughs> yeah. You can feel it. You're Daisy. <laughs> oh yeah. I was like, I'm either gonna go out knocking him out or I'm getting knocked out. <laughs> But I was like really dizzy and discombobulated for sure at that point. Yep. But I'm still going. <laughs> I think there, if there's one area that you could capitalize too. The leg kicks? Yeah. yeah. You got to his legs, dude. Yeah, but that was kind of a sloppy shot, I think. We got in there, though. It's okay, though. It's okay because sometimes even if you don't get the shot, you still make them think. Right. And it can open other things up. I, see, I can tell you're getting ready to throw that. that uh, I saw your yeah, head. Like, oh, that shit's coming. I needed, I needed to do something because I needed to get that round back. But Boom. nah. Go to the body. Bink. Uh, this is where he caught you off balance, I think. It's coming. It's coming. The jab started landing for me. But I made the, I made the Ooh, mistake of thank over. God. You, you caught a bit of his tricep, though. I, I feel like I caught the whole elbow, bro. <laughs> I remember <laughs> that hurt. <laughs> What's Terrell telling you? I don't remember. I don't think I remember past the freaking third round. Yeah. I don't remember much after that. Oof. It was pretty pretty hurt at that point. Round number three. At this point, I don't even remember what I was thinking. I just remember, like, keep your damn hands up, move your head, move your feet. And stay active. Boom. I'm trying to go for that body kick. That inside leg kick again sucks. Yeah, that's why. And that, and that partially, that's probably what kind of forced you to find the inside. You know? Yeah, I needed to rush and take away that space so that he don't he stop yeah, kicking. That's me. why when you start threatening people with takedowns. Yeah. It just it starts to open up the game a little bit. Yeah, more. I then, agree. Then, then they won't then they won't rely on their kicking so right. much. No, and it just makes them think. Is he gonna go bottom? Is he gonna go up top? Right. I'm trying to see where where it is that I can go in there. A chink in the armor, as they say. You know, I went to the body there. I'm trying to figure out where it is I can go. Whether it be up top, up the bottom, Ooh, up nice. top. Ooh, did that knee come in? That knee did not go in, no. And then I start noticing my jab landing a little bit more, so I throw it more. I'm trying to faint, see if he falls for any of them. He doesn't. He's so freaking good. Boom! Freaking kick he's so fast with. But he usually he throws his right hand behind that kick. Boom, and then throws the right hand, but no. It's like just... Whitaker. Like Whitaker does a really good time of throwing that right, and then the kick yeah. falls up. Oh, I've, I've felt it. <laughs> yeah, it's either the right hand lands or the kick lands. Yeah. It's crazy. I felt both, and there's that inside leg kick again. But I am keeping my best poker face. <laughs> Boom. Yeah, I think now even, now it's just level changes. Now what you understand now? Kelvin, of, of of coming out of fakes, distance, smoking, double smoking. Yeah, no, I get that now. And then also a, a more a bigger wrestling game. I feel I'm more confident in, in it yeah. these days. Yeah. And every once in a while, too, that lead leg, a lead leg kick. Lead leg kicks. I'm throwing more lead leg kicks now. I'm I'm just seeing different things from a different perspective these days. I mean, I, this was four years ago. I mean, uh, you know, different fighter back then. Yeah. I was like, ooh, okay, he's trying yeah, to go for take counts. Boop, boop. Yeah, now boop. he's, uh, 
he's he's basic, man. Israel's just basic. He'll boom. I mean, he'll he'll try and be flashy if he can, but it's always back to the basics, right? I just think there's a lot. I, I think I just think like knowing what you know now. Yeah. Yeah. See, he does a good yeah, job. He, think... he he does a good job of that versifying his kicks, bro. He, he'll pull it to the oh, yeah. body every once in a while, but he, the majority of the time he'll go to the legs, and every once in a while he'll fuck with you, and go to your head or your body. But his priority are the legs. Yeah. We see a lot of fighters they just head hunt or. They can stick Boom. to one particular area a little too see that much. that nice little slip with the one-two. I feel like that's the mistake a lot of fighters, like you said, do. Is they, they, nice. They don't. Nice. Boom. There it is. There, there it go. is. That's what I needed to do more of. You know? Yeah, don't. Don't, Kelvin. Ah! Ah! I'm like, damn it. Damn it. Yeah, All, that mom, All that work for nothing. All that work for nothing. And it was something that I will say about Israel when he does get taken down or whatever, like he will, he'll change the game and he will press forward. Oh yeah, like he yeah, will he shy away to, from. He needs to turn it up. He will turn it up. I mean, he showed that in this fight. You know, I mean, we, I mean, we both showed how much we can dig. You know what I mean? Like, I did not expect him to have that big of a shovel to be able to dig down that deep in, inside of himself. I know how far I can dig. I didn't think he can dig as far. Yeah. Boom. Yeah, that uh, that last takedown, Calvin. Yeah, that could have won me that. That yeah. could have won me that round. Yeah, but it's. Is that inside leg kick again? It's important for you to. Uh, it's important for you to see that stuff. Because th there's times you don't, you don't necessarily have to damage somebody. Just control somebody. You can win a round. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I, th I think I could have decisively won that round if I would have kept him on the ground. That's the problem that I've had is I can take anybody in the world down, but can you keep them down? That's another thing. Yeah, start, start, getting, start getting to come to the scorpion, locking up the legs, Khabib style, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, I'm about to. You know, you know what? Oh, God, that sucks, dude, because I was like, ugh. That take that could have won you the fight, dude. Because it's right now it's... Yeah, look at Terrell all fired up. Yeah, right now it's 2-1. Uh, 2-1. Two -one. Two -one. Uh, uh, Arasanya. Yeah. His back. Let's go, baby. Let's go, KG. Hey, hey. <laughs> I, I remember seeing the clip of you on the... Uh, on the yeah. rails from <laughs> bro. <laughs> You, you were over here somewhere. I think I, I think I was with the date, dude. You were with the date that day? I saw you next to Kamar Usman. The Nigerian nightmare. Boom. Yep. Right Boom. Away. And then this Boom. one's like right away. I need to I need but to bring the, the heat. This is, but this is exactly what this is exactly what you need. This is the kind of fight you yep, need yep, to have. Yep. And then notice how you went low. Yeah. Go a little, go low a little bit more just to uh, mm -hmm. get in the thick of it and then go high. Yeah, I noticed that it did work. Changing levels on these high, but, taller guys will make a big difference. Yeah, they but, won't know where you're coming from if you're changing levels. Yeah, but look how much success you're having. It's early. It's 30 seconds, but you're We're already... 30 seconds in, yeah. Boom. You see how he throws that right hand out uh, after that kick? Yeah. He still likes to do that. That lead leg, man. Either snatches or kick his lead I leg. I know, dude. man. There's so many things I would do differently these days, you know. Uh, but it's all right. It's all right. We're gonna get. We're gonna work our way back up. You know, he's not the champion no more. Who knows? He, maybe he will be later on this year. But uh, people want to see Rocky too. This yeah. is Rocky one. We need the sequel, baby. Rocky and Apollo. <laughs> Rocky and Apollo, baby. <laughs> and guess what happens in Rocky 2? Who wins? Hey! Come on, that's man. That's right. <laughs> that's right. You know? Boom! You see how he starts winging those hooks instead of throwing them straight now? Yeah, you do a good job of not showing any fucking fatigue on your face. Oh, I know. I, I, you stuck I'm hard. pretty proud of my poker face, I'll tell you that. I am hurting like no other, but I keep a pretty cool poker face. Yeah. Fa, fa, pa. I can Ooh. tell you, you want to throw that left hand. Hell up. yeah. Ah. But he's so far, he's so good with his movement. Yeah. You see how he just escaped that? 
Yeah, but those are all patterns, dude. Those are all patterns that he's doing. He just got. He just got to. He just got to. You have to adjust your distance now, yeah. with fakes and feints. Man, those leg kicks are there all day. You know, yeah. smoke, smoke, smoke. Then throw your power and, shots. And who took advantage of that? Pereira did. Mm. Pereira took advantage of that. And I said You're it all the so time. Right. That's our producer, Michael Wands, over You're here. You're so right. I said. That, I said the way you beat Israel is he. He can give a kick. He can give punches. But look at his position. Look at his stance. He's too heavy on that front leg. Yeah. Yeah, you're winning this round, dude. You got him! You're He's look, look open! At, look at this dude. <laughs> you heard him, Rock! <laughs> yeah. And then now working with Everton with a lot of your angles now? Yes. Like stepping that, on that outside yeah, foot. Yeah, small little getting things. Out of the, getting out of the, yeah, stepping out on that outside foot. Not going inside, you know? Boom, boom. Throw that jab. That boom. jab is landing. So now I'm figuring it's my second or third shot that's landing, right? But I'm trying to throw everything in my first and second. Yeah. Ooh, Ooh beautiful, beautiful mm. left, dude. I don't know if you guys caught that. Foo, yeah, yeah, no, we were exchanging there. We were gonna just stood in front of each other and. Uh, but you do a you do a good you you do a good job of slipping and throwing. Yeah, that's one thing I I feel I did a lot better than a lot of the fighters he's fought is uh, my 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 head movement, my slips. You see that poker face? <laughs> go back, go back on that one. <laughs> look when he look when he kicks me. Look my face. Ow. I'm thinking that hurt. I'm thinking that yeah, hurt. Like, oh, did, <laughs> didn't hurt. <laughs> didn't hurt. Yup, nice. But it was it was that dude. It was aggression of taking kicks. space from him. Oh yeah. And it was affecting you're just going for it and you're slipping. It's what made round four. Yeah, look and how that, I slipped that. Boom. And that's all it is. You just gotta pick a damn side, but you can't stay here. Yeah. And it's not big movements either. It's just little, little Sorry. slips. Uh, uh, That's what a lot of people uh, uh. think. is just like these big, nope, it's little ones. Joe said it. Here, come with my switch. One, two, kick. Oh, beautiful. Look at, look at, look at. Yeah. He, look. I didn't realize roller blades, how hurt bro. he was until I threw that, that uh, left. Yeah, when you got somebody hurt here in these positions, Calvin. So here's the thing. I'm thinking he's hurt. I'm going to take him down, and I'm going to submit him. And become the new interim. But no, obviously that didn't happen. Yeah, fuck. Ooh, you he, know? he fought you, though. He came and then back. he came back firing hard. I was like, okay. Yeah. After, after I heard him. I, I think when you got somebody hurt, man, if you, if you can drive some uppercuts down the middle. Pff, I know. Those, uh, those punches, I feel like when somebody hurts, people don't see those. Dude. Man, I know. A lot of people give me shit for it, but it is Boom, what it again. Is. Again. Boom. Ah, I would have said kept that on your feet, dude. Well, just to yeah, like, solidify it. No, like you I'm solidified thinking, it 100%. Yeah, I know I did. 100%. I'm feeling good at that That's point. That's good. So right now it's 2-2. Two, 2-2. Two. Two, two. Round one, Calvin to the deal, double G. Round four to KG. And obviously two and three is to yeah, Israel. Two and two going into the fifth. And obviously the fifth we'll see well, right let's, now. Well, let's see. We'll see how maybe, it turns out. Maybe I win. <laughs> You know, but he's so good at just barely evading these shots. Here it comes. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but he's, he's look, but evading, but look what he leaves behind, dude. His feet. Like, he leaves behind his body. Yeah. And I his, and gone his in legs. There, made me wrap them up. Yeah. Boom. Oof. That's what I'm saying, dude, for a short dude. I guarantee he probably didn't think he'd get your leg up that high. That was for a short Kings, baby. Hey. <laughs> This guy, come on, yeah. the comeback, baby, it's Hell happening. Hell yeah, dude, I felt confident going into this fifth. I was like, ah! <laughs> ah! I was out my seat. Dude. I was feeling good, too, going into the fifth. I actually don't remember what, what that part, but. Yeah, right away. This is what I love about you, bro, in this fight. You fucking oh, brought yeah. the pressure right away. Always, always. You brought the pressure right away. I just right feel like away. my pressure's different. The way I bring my pressure is different from a lot of the other fighters. I'm either going to wrestle you hard or box you real hard. Like, my pressure is just different. I feel like I believe in it. Yeah. But and I, that's why I'm so confident going forward, you know? But I'm telling you, I'm telling you Kelvin, like, your, your poker face, bro, is what makes you really good in your anticipation. You anticipate very, very well. 
and you're able to hold composure. I, I know your shit's hurt, dude. Yeah, that shit's hurt. I know. Hurt. Well, that people hurt. who have never fought before or without shin pads, up. Yeah. Guys, it takes three kicks and you're a different no, fighter. No, my, my, my leg was was swollen and purple for weeks after. And that, <laughs> uh, yeah, it, it sucked. You couldn't you could play the you couldn't play the the accordion. Boom. Boom. Ooh, nah, you see what I'm right saying? Like, no, but yeah, you threw kicks, it. But those you kicks threw are it. there, man. I don't know why I didn't throw more of those kicks. Those kicks are there. Yeah, catch him right on top of that muscle like you did. And Beautiful. Look, he caught me with another hooking hook. Oh, right, Kelvin. Oh, man, he did a good job. of. Uh, so I'm breathing for, let's see, let's see for how long. Oh, I'm not nice. breathing. Nice. And he transitioned. Oh, you just keep him here, you'd be, you'd be, ah. I know. Look how hard it is to get those legs off of me, though. He's got these long ass legs. I'm like, what the hell? I can't get these legs. Ah! Off. <laughs> I couldn't get those damn long legs off of me. But I feel like if I would have kept them on the ground right there, yeah, maybe. Just kept them. Yeah. Right. I would have camped all day. I don't care how boring it is. I would have that's stayed be, there. That's why I beat Demetri Johnson. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you, you just control them. That's all you do. Control. Like, hey, they raised your hand at the end. Exactly. I was there. Hey. I was there. Boom. Now we're. So I was nice. tired. After right. No, no. Yeah. Was it? Was it because of that triangle? That kind of. After the 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 good. The guillotine. guillotine. Then he had the triangle, and then we had the scramble. All that breath was not breathing, and now I'm trying to catch up. Now my, my lungs are trying to catch up at this time. Oh, okay, but you, do you feel like you're losing this round? Oh yeah. When, 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 after those two, before those two right hands, I thought you. I thought it was even. But I'm still. My shit's still trying to. I'm still trying to catch up. My shit's still trying to recover, but I'm still going forward. And then now he's able to he he's able to capitalize on me not being as agile, not having as much breath, and uh, just kicks the living shit out of me. <laughs> you know, but it's crazy how you get a guy to go to that point to where he says, "I don't, uh, what did he say? I don't. I'm gonna die, or I'm not gonna. I don't remember what he I'm said. I'm ready to die. I'm, I'm ready to die." To die. That's crazy that he went to those, to that dimension, to be able to take somebody to those, I don't know, to that kind of thinking. Yeah. Ooh, he caught you with that. Yeah, from right, right now, the ball's rolling on his side now, dude. Oh, yeah, 100%. I, I, I feel like, I feel like looking back at it now, I'd be like, if I was in your corner, I'd be like, save zone, catch your fucking breath. Catch your breath before you go out. Yeah, I, I'm, out. <laughs> I'm out. I'm <laughs> out. I don't know yeah, why. Man, I'm, I'm just like, like ah! You should have stayed down, son. That, that's a beating you about to take. <laughs> no, but, you know, obviously I'm trying to fight. I'm still trying to win. You know? I don't yeah. care. Uh, I came here yeah. to win. I came here to win. I yeah. don't care. Man, but you know what? That second... Oh, watching this fight now, dude. Oh, if yeah, you would have stayed on top of him in the fifth when you were on top of him, or even that, that second round... Yeah. Bro, on, bro, this move? fight was in your this this fight was in your hands, dude. Yeah, but right now you're on you're on E, bro. And this dude smells it. Oh yeah, hundred percent. He knows it. Come on. I tell you what, the Mar Mark Goddard is one hell of you did a good job there, dude. Just switch position there. So Mark got a lot of flack for that because they were saying, oh, he should have stopped the fight. But Mark, I remember him. I saw him maybe a few months after this, and he was just telling me like how I, I was still good. He saw me that I was still fighting. Oh, oh! <laughs> I was hurting, bro. I think he's one of the best in the game. No, he, he is the best in the game. He is. He really is. Yeah, Mark Goddard is. Damn, hell of a fight, dude. Hey! Yeah. Look, we, even, we, we, look, we got the producer. We got everybody here clapping, Calvin. We got the 2019 oh, Future Inductee Hall of Fame. Hey. Oh, here we go. We got the award, baby. Fight of the year. This is the uh, little trophy that I got. What was he Thank asking you, you real quick? Shoot, yeah. I don't Oh, I think if he was like, yeah. are you all right? Or asking yeah. medical yeah. 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 Uh, yeah. Adrian. Yeah. I was going, Adrian. <laughs> 
<laughs> Damn, that's good stuff, dude. Uh, that was a hell. That was a good fight, yeah, dude. Yeah. And then you know when when they uh, were raising our hands or calling the cars, I still think like maybe I could yeah, have had three yeah, of those. Yeah, because of round two, bro. Yeah. Because of or round, round two. three, maybe. Was it round two that we're talking about? I think it was round three. Because round two, he knocked me down. Round okay, three was yeah. closer. Okay, so it was one, one and three. Yeah. yeah. One, three, and five. Oh, no, one and... Shit. One and four for me, he did two. Looking, uh, looking, looking back at it now, what are some of the areas that you think made you have such success in this fight with him? And what are some things that you would do different if you were to fight him again? I, I, I bring a bigger wrestling, heavy, heavier game on the wrestling. That way, it opens up my striking a lot more. Yeah, I feel like if I did, if I would have done that, then then Bring it would have that Yuma, that Yuma State. Title. It would I would have brought that, that that Yuma Heat if I used my wrestling a little bit more. It would have opened up a lot more things in the striking department. Damn! Look at his face. Dude. Can we pause that real quick? <laughs> Actually, look at both of their damn faces. Oh yeah, he cut me up pretty good. He, he, he looked like that. Uh, he looked like the freaking was it uh the dude from uh, the Goonies. <laughs> Come That's on, his name? Slot? Oh Slot. no, man, it's that's bad. But then look at him, dude. I mean, he's beat up, dude. I, there's so many other things I would have done differently. I mean, more wrestling, smoking more of the hands instead of trying to kill with just the one-two. You know what I mean? Smoke yeah. the hands more, a little bit more heavier kick game, a yeah. little bit more heavier wrestling game. Just do a lot of MMA, more MMA. I wanted to go in there and kill. Like I should have yeah. been, I should have had a better strategy, better plan, and uh, not as been as as eager to just throw yeah. blows. Yeah, and I think uh, I think your experience too, the fact that you've been in there with yeah. with the best middleweights in the world is what's uh, is what's made you you know successful now. Like oh, like, yeah. like like you, like you come like you come like you come you're coming out you, you you're coming out with a different swagger now, and I think that's what uh. So it's, crazy. it's crazy. It's crazy. I, I feel know, like but, this but, next this next phase of my but career. But can I tell you something, Kelvin? What? I still think you won that fight. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Yeah, yeah, no. Come on. We ain't doing that again. <laughs> <laughs> we ain't doing that again. People hated it. When we when we walked around in Australia with your belt. It was funny. It was Henry's Hey, belt. but it cut your title shot. It did. It did. And it got people. Hey, people weren't even talking about his fight the next day. They were talking about how I was walking around <laughs> with the belt the next day. So it worked. <laughs> but, hey, guys, thank you, Triple C, my guest of the night. Guys, this is uh, what we'll be doing, this little preview, our first episode for the Kelvin Gaslam YouTube channel. I uh, hope you guys enjoy the breakdown. Go ahead and subscribe to it if you haven't already. We're going to be doing a lot more projects here coming soon, so go ahead and subscribe. None of this would be possible without our sponsors. Hey, Jimmy Bars, baby. Go ahead and check them out. I love it. I love me getting some immune boost. This is the caramel and cookies and cream, but the immune boost is my favorite. So go ahead and check them out. Jimmy Bars, baby. Get your Jimmy on. Triple C, anything to add? No, that's it. We nope. are out.